how y'all doing today? Ah! Guys, I'm so excited because I'm about to teach y'all some of my little tricky tricks on how I used to, because your girl Mary, I don't got crushes no more, but uh, how I used to get my crushes to like me without talking to them. So yes, I'm going to teach you how to get your crush to like you without you having to talk to them. It is four ways. So stay tuned because I'm about to get into it. And before I do that, please subscribe to my channel. Give my videos a thumbs up if you like them, which hopefully you do. And turn my post notifications on. Follow me on Instagram, all of that good stuff, whatever. But like, um, you know I got to say that now so you don't forget later on. Okay, so without further ado, let's get to it. Number one, this is the first way to get your crush to like you without you having to talk to them, okay? You want to make sure that you are in the same area as your crush is in. Not all the time, you have to know how to play your cards right, okay? So for example, you are in high school, you're in college, wherever it is, and you know your crush likes to eat lunch at a certain time, or they have to eat lunch at a certain time. Make sure you eat lunch at that time too. If you have a different lunch period, go to the bathroom and make your way in the area so your crush could see you. Your crush can notice you. If you are in the same area as your crush, eventually they're going to start realizing who is this person, like who is this girl or who is this boy that is always around. I'm not going to get to know them because obviously you're going to look good. This is your crush. You're going to be looking cute or whatever. So your crush is going to start noticing you and your crush is going to be like, hmm, this person kind of seems to like the same things that I like or do the same things that I do. And it's just like an unconscious like thing that they're not even going to realize that they are starting to notice you more. They're not even going to realize it, okay? So you want to be in the same areas as your crush is, okay? I'm pretty sure you know at least one of their friends or you notice something that they always like to do. Do they always like to go to a particular store? Do they always go to the bathroom around this time or this particular bathroom in this particular hallway? Do you notice that they get to school every morning a half an hour early to kick it with their homeboys or their homegirls in front of the school? Or work, do you notice that they come to work a half hour early or they come to work late? Make sure that you kind of figure out like the little things that they like to do and place yourself in that area, okay? Cool. Number two, make the same friends, okay? So if you want your crush to like you, you need to have some type of common connection with them, okay? And a friend is a good place to start. Now, don't just be friends with any and everybody that you see that your crush is friends with. You want to actually have a real friendship with this person because you don't want your friends to feel like they're being used, okay? So find a friend that is cool with your crush, that hangs out with your crush, or that does something is some in the class with your crush a partner with your crush um if they ride the same bus or the same train to school or to work with their crush if uh they work with them you know you want to find somebody that you can call your friend and you can kind of just like pop up like hey girl like how you doing today whatever whatever and like have a conversation with them so that way you could be in the same area as your crush does that make sense you get where i'm going you see how this goes full circle okay because eventually if you are friends with a friend of your crush your crush is gonna notice you and y'all gonna have an exchange he's gonna have to say something to you or she's gonna have to say something to you at some Point. If you are shy like that, this is a great way for your crush to have to say something to you first, okay? Also, when you are friends with your friend's crush, wait, if you are friends with your crush's friend, eventually your friend is going to say something about you to your crush. Something, like something random, something general. Maybe they're having a conversation about strawberries and you and your friend had a conversation about strawberries like an hour earlier or a couple days and they are going to mention you in that conversation which is also going to pique your crush's brain and um, 
they gonna start wondering like who is this person like let me talk to this person type of thing okay number three make eye contact and smile oh my god it is so easy you do not have to talk to them if you happen to look in their direction which you probably will be looking in their direction because you got a crush on them and they cute or whatever so if you are looking in their direction and they happen to glance your way or notice that you're looking at them I know it's difficult and I know it's super easy to be shy but try not to be so shy try to make eye contact with them and smile okay so for example if you're like doing this and then you happen to look over and they look at you just like like that so easy literally was at two seconds got it one two three and then just keep going about your day okay they're gonna realize that you smile they're gonna say oh in their head they're probably gonna be like oh maybe this person has a little bit of interest in me they're gonna see your pearly whites they are going to see that you're a happy person they're gonna see that you are confident okay even though you're not talking to them the fact that you smiled at them, the fact that you connected through eye contact and you didn't like shy away and like look away and look down, they're gonna be like, oh my God, like this person has confidence. Guys, that was a big deal for me. Even when I was in high school, I don't know why it was so important to me, but I will never forget this guy tried to talk to me and I was on my way home from school and he was in high school. I was like a freshman. He was probably like a junior or senior in another school. And like he was kind of cute, he was alright, and he was talking to me, he's just like, hey, so I applauded the fact that he came out of his shell to kind of talk to me. So while he's talking to me, I'm just looking at him, because like, you know, I want to see if he's cute, I want to see what he's about. And he was getting shy, like, I was like, how did you approach me to talk to me, and now you can't even make eye contact with me? Like, it was so uncomfortable for me. And I just felt like, okay, if you can't make eye contact with me and you're shy like this, like, I don't, I don't like you, I don't want you, you're not confident, you don't have um, a strong personality that I would be attracted to, and mm, you're not for me. Sorry, peace out, bye, bye. So that's very important, guys, if you guys happen to make eye contact, which you should be trying to make eye contact with your crush, smile okay don't make it weird don't keep staring at them kind of like smile <laughs> and look away okay and do not constantly stare at them and keep smiling because that can get weird too okay like know your role and play your part accordingly thanks number four okay if you are in high school if you are at work and you have a crush on somebody this is the easiest place to send them a card or give them candy something like that okay now if you are in school I remember in high school uh, every Valentine's Day I feel like maybe Christmas too they had like this thing in school where you can just like pick people's names and like pay a dollar and they will give them a candy cane or they would give them like a heart or some chocolates or something on behalf of you and it'll, you can put a card if you want you can send it anonymously if you want it was all good and it was super super cute and it was so cute and special so if you have that in your school take advantage of that okay you are able to talk to your crush without actually talking to them and they're gonna like you for this they are going to really appreciate that and they're gonna be like wow like this person sent me like a candy or this person thought of me to send me something special like it is really guys that was that is really special like when I used to get them I used to be like damn like I like oh my god like this person likes me like super cute I hated when I got anonymous ones like they were so nice but I never knew who they were coming from so I didn't know who to thank. If you work with them, that's even more clutch because sometimes they do have the similar like programs where you can like, you know, pay and like give a candy cane or some chocolates to somebody, but you're kind of like an adult if you're at work or whatever. So just take this opportunity, get your own card, put it on their desk, put it in their coat, just give it to them and you don't even have to say anything to them. You're still making the first step. And they're still going to like you for that because it is super sweet and super nice. And they have to come over now to say thank you, okay? I'm um, trying to think of any other way that uh, you would have a crush. Like maybe at the gym, you can do the same thing. Give the person a card. If you know their birthday, oh my god, even better. Like give them a card for their birthday. 
Um, I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think. And it doesn't have to be anything crazy. You don't have to have a whole long drawn out like, oh my god, I like you, do you like me? Yes or no, check the box. No, it don't have to be none of that. It could just be like a simple happy birthday to so and so from Lisa Unique. Great. Happy holidays. I hope you have a wonderful holiday. Here's a candy cane. Enjoy it from Lisa Unique. Like, like that's it. So simple. And they're gonna come and thank you, and they're gonna like you for that. They trust me. Trust me. You welcome. So those are my four ways on how to get your crush to like you without you even having to talk to them okay it is so easy so simple uh good luck to you guys i hope you get your crush to like you if you do comment below if you have any other tips or tricks on how to get your crush to like you without talking to them please leave it in the comments below so we can all help each other out because you know like that's what youtube is these families so Make sure you be my families and subscribe to my channel, of course, like I asked before. And thanks for watching. Good luck, guys. Keep it geek, freak, chic, and sleek. But most importantly, keep it unique. Bye, guys.